right, that was just my Southern Homestyle biscuits that I cut into four pieces. Now I'm gonna go ahead and grab my cast iron 13 by nine, and I'm gonna throw in my little biscuit pieces. I heavily greased this with some olive oil. This is gonna be such an easy and delicious dinner. All you need is four ingredients, and then you have a delicious Mexican-inspired dinner. Okay, let's go ahead and get all these biscuits in here. This is gonna be so good. All right, I added a few more biscuits. Now I'm coming in with my red enchilada sauce. This is the 19 ounce can. And we are gonna pour that whole can right on top of these biscuits. They're just gonna soak up and just, when they cook, they're gonna absorb all of that delicious enchilada sauce. Now I'm coming in with one rotisserie chicken that I shredded and seasoned, and we're just gonna evenly spread that right on top of our biscuits and enchilada sauce. Oh yeah, smells so good, that enchilada sauce. You could use a green enchilada sauce if you don't like the red. I know that green goes really well with chicken, and you can also swap out the chicken for ground beef. Whatever you like, that's what you can use. Okay, now before we add our last ingredient, I'm just gonna go ahead and mix this entire thing together right in our cast iron, just like this. Now you don't need to use a cast iron 13 by nine, any standard 13 by nine will work. I just like the cast iron because it helps keep the flavor nice and potent. Okay, oh, this is gonna be really good. It's so easy for a weekday meal. Everyone loves it. You can serve it with, you know, a little taco salad on the side, or you could add some, you know, fresh lettuce on top when we're done cooking it. However you wanna serve this, your family will love it. Just make sure everything is coated in that delicious enchilada sauce. And then we're gonna spread it out for our last but most important step, everyone's favorite ingredient. If you follow me, you probably know what it is. And that is cheese. I'm using the Tillamook Mexican four cheese. I said it right this time. You guys gotta give me credits in the comments for saying Tillamook correctly, okay? And we're just spreading that right on top. We're not gonna mix it in. We want a nice cheese crust on top of our enchilada chicken biscuits. Oh my gosh, I know that sounds crazy, but it's so good, you guys. I promise you, I would not steer you wrong. This is a recipe I made my made up myself and I am obsessed with it. Okay, that looks delicious. My oven is set to 350 and this is gonna cook for 25 to 30 minutes. Oh my, would you look at that. Now I did let this cool for about 10 minutes and it looks so good. It's ready to eat. Look at those puffed up biscuits. right out oh, yeah that looks so good those biscuits are cooked perfectly the cheese is nice and melted mm, okay it was time to give this a try oh, you know what? I'm just gonna go for this one right here mmm mmm that is so good, you guys. Mm. You gotta try it. 